another video. All things must come to an end. This is the last week of you guys seeing my new service. I carry it so sad. We're on number four. So, for you guys, this will have been four weeks. For me, this will have been five seconds. Stick in my heart like it really is. Cause I can't take another no. I see, I like, I go. I realize that might actually go with that leather harness. We'll see. Anyway, let's get to the last one. So obviously I know which one this one is, and I'm so excited because this one has some really customizable things that I love. So I'm just gonna look in the box this time. And of course, with all of her purchases, you also get he's <laughs> like silly. Um, you get care instructions and stuff. I know the embroidery ones can't be left out in the sun and stuff because it's not good for the embroidery. But anyway. Okay, back boy. You already ate all the goodies. Thank you. So Oh my gosh. Okay, guys. I'm not going to even lie. This is my favorite one out of all my... I mean, I love all the things I got. Don't get me wrong. This is one of my all-time favorite things I have at the moment. This is... My baby, I love it. Some people say they love the, because I posted some of the pictures on Instagram, like stories. Some of them say they love the Alice one the best. I have to say, for me, personally, this is my favorite one. Oh my gosh, I love it! I can't even. I'm so sad this is the last one for you guys. At least we're ending up on a big note. I'm not going to lie. I, I am obsessed with this cape. This is my, my baby. I love it. So, let me talk about it before I just freak out over and over again. So, this one is obviously also kind of representative. This one also is obviously like an autism more themed one. So it's got a tree and then it's got the little puzzle pieces on top. Again, colorful, not just blue puzzle pieces. But my favorite feature I have ever had on a cape is right here in the tree. It says L plus P and it's in a heart. So our initials are carved in a heart. Mine and Patches is obviously. I think I keep looking at myself in the viewfinder through all these if I'm like, that's why I, it's hard for me to look at the camera. Anyway, and plus I'm trying to look to make sure I'm showing you guys like it because it's hard if I'm looking at the camera to try and like make sure it's in frame. But anyway, so it's so cool. At the bottom of the tree it says service dog and it's literally like in the tree roots. And then of course the L plus P. And then on the side it says service dog and then it's got um, a puzzle piece and it's no touch, talk, or pictures. Again, like all of the other ones. And then it says give us space, which is the first one I have that I, when she said that I almost was like, well I think she wanted to do stay back or something. I was like, I don't really like stay back on service dog gear just because I don't know if they'll think my dog's aggressive or not and I don't want that to come across but I do like give us space because that makes more sense <laughs> to me and so she did that which I really like I love teal teal is my favorite color which is how come I did teal it is not blue as we keep talking about it is teal um I love teal so that is why I wanted teal um and it is amazing look at that tree um for me this kind of represents everything, like even though the puzzle pieces are on the tree. Um, and I almost wanted like a teal like leaves around them, but I'm so glad they took my original picture because that was my original idea. And then I was like, oh, maybe like teal leaves around it and the puzzle pieces are more like apples in the tree, you know, kind of thing. But no, they did exactly right. They <laughs> stuck to my original idea, which I love. I mean, they would have changed it if I said, but I really like that they just stuck to my original plan. Um, because it's amazing. It's a fairy tale tree. Oh, look it. I never even noticed that. Do you see it? It's a heart. It's amazing. Anyway, <laughs> so um, for me, even though this is like obviously representative of autism because it's got the autism theme to it, I feel like it's just kind of everything. Like it's just everything about me put together. So the puzzle pieces on this, even though it is 
also for my autism. Um, I feel like it's also just about, you know, like one's PTSD, one's my chronic illness, a chronic illness, one's another chronic illness, a lung disease, um, another <laughs> lung disease, you know, like, um, PTSD, autism, like, I just feel like each piece is kind of like, like, I obviously didn't, like, count them out and be like, oh, one for everything, so it's not like that at all, like, I never said that, I just said a puzzle piece is on in a fairy tale tree, so I never said anything like that at all, but, so it's not like necessarily like all everything, but like, you know what I mean? Like just different traits about myself. And I feel like they're just sitting on a tree, even though I might have more or less. I don't know. I haven't counted everything, but you know what I mean? So I just feel like for me, this one's just kind of representative. This kind of represents everything. I can't talk today. Never want to film gear unboxings when you can't talk. But for me, this just represents everything about myself, every single thing. And so that's how I like it, but it's also autism themed, obviously, so it's kind of for me both. I feel like the public will just look at them and be like, oh, maybe autism, but it's for me, it's just kind of everything, so I love it. My all-time favorite, I know I'm going to keep saying this, but is that freaking L plus P. I said, ooh, if you could carve an L plus P in a heart on the tree, that would be amazing. <laughs> and she was like, I don't know if we'll be able to fit that where it's noticeable, and I'm like, please do your best please. I need it. That would be the best thing ever. And she was able to fit it, which makes me so ecstatic. It makes me so happy. I mean, I already know she fit it because she sent me pictures, but it's so funny because she sends you pictures when your gear is done, but it always looks so much better when you like actually see it and unbox it and see the like vibrant of the colors. Um, and on my camera, they always look exactly like I got it, but like I don't know why, it's just like in person, it always looks even so much better than just the pictures you saw. So, I love it. Um, here's one more close-up. I'm not even going to lie, out of everything I got, this is my favorite thing I have ever. It's amazing. So this one I was thinking would just go on the white one because obviously teal and white. I could always get a teal one for it. I do want a teal harness because teal harnesses are pretty. But, um... I figured that would be pretty too, just on the white harness. That's actually one of the reasons I wanted this white harness, because I thought that would look good with this. Um, now I'm thinking maybe, I mean, that looks good, but a teal one would also look good, so maybe both. I don't know if I would like a teal one, though, because it could be too much teal for it. I do want a teal harness, but I don't know if I'll put this on it. But I do like this with the white. White just goes good with everything. <laughs> oh my gosh. So I think that's it for this unboxing. Wow, these videos are like literally in normal length limits and not Lydia's limits which is always like 20 minute gear unboxings <laughs> best thing in the world that is so amazing so yeah originally i didn't even know if there was going to be something here i said just service egg with the logos and then she was like oh we should have something there because it's going to look empty and i was like okay so amazing i love the font she used on it too oh yes let's do our little buckle so i did another gold one <laughs> I'm getting exhausted from doing these gear unboxings, but I do like doing it. It's just it's a little bit tiring. Oh my gosh, I love it. Okay, well, I'm going to end this, and then I will show you all the gear on my amazing dog who is sleeping right there off camera. Again, YouTube is my thing, not his thing, so I'm not going to make him, but my gear wall looks amazing. I'll also show you guys that probably in this video. So that'll probably be like the last video you see with my be my gear wall with everything on it. Wow. I'm a, I'm in love with this cape. It is so amazing. I love the way it snaps. She's, I just love everything about this cape. So. Okay, so here is the very last cape. It is so cute. It's possibly my favorite. We're exhausted. <laughs> you can lay down, buddy. Good boy. Um, so we're just gonna lay down. I'm exhausted too, but this is the last one, so there it is. I love all my gear, they're amazing. <laughs> and I will show you guys my gear wall as of right now after this clip, so that'll be the last thing you guys see. So I know I just put them all on the white harness for now, by the way. Everything looks good on the white harness, and so it's just easier for me than to have to try and switch them all. Um, so that is why I did that, but so cute, I love it so much, so yeah.
So there is the gear wall. Wow, I'm so proud of my collection. Look how amazing it is with the updated gear. And I love the colors of all of them because it just adds like the Disney one is red but it's not really colorful and same with that one that those two are obviously just black and white and gray um so i love that the rest of my capes now have added nice color to it and then with the red harness and everything it just looks so bright and happy and cheerful and focus focus i can't focus on any one thing so it's having a hard time but i'll go closer up again but wow look at that gear wall I'm so in love with my gear wall. I'm proud of it. Besides my dog, I've got to say it's one of my most accomplished things. And then, of course, the red port down below. But, yeah. So, that is the updated gear wall. YouTube. Golden Doodle Corner. Wow. So pretty. I love all my gear. It's amazing. So. And then, there's pictures of us, if you didn't know. But yeah, I'm exhausted, so I'm gonna go now. Um, I just wanted to show you guys the end. I did hang these ones up like this. Once they wear out more like this, I'll be able to probably put them like that. But for now, they're not worn out yet, so they're still stiff. So I just put them like that, which is fine. That works. It's cute. I might actually keep them like that. But yeah, so I love all my gear. I love my gear collection. I officially have six capes and five harnesses. And then two vests, tuxedo and that one. So yeah, it's really cool. I love it. Okay, so please like, comment, subscribe, and do all the things. And I will see you guys later. Bye.